Hi, welcome to Lesson 2, Unit 14. This is the description of all the vocabulary words. So let's get started. Softball. Claw hand shapes and bring your hands together as if in the shape of a softball. Basketball. Take the five hand shapes, palms together, and bring it up as if you're throwing up a basketball. Baseball. The S hand shapes um, together like this as if you're hitting a baseball. Football. The five hand shapes, pretend these are the people and they're going at each other. Football. Hockey. The base hand is in the five hand shape, palm faces up. Um, the dominant is with the X hand shape, palm facing up, and as if you're going across the ice. Hockey. Soccer. Take the base hand in the five, the dominant in the five, and you're kicking, the dominant is kicking the base hand. Soccer. Tennis, as if you're holding the tennis racket and hitting the uh, ball with the racket. Tennis. Golf, it's almost like softball, but now you bring your hands down like this as if you're hitting a golf ball. Golf. Ball is the same as softball, um, bringing the fingertips together. Wrong. Take the Y hand shape, palm facing in, and touch your chin. Wrong. Happen. The one hand shape, palm faces up, then turn them down. Happen. This is like what happened to you the other day. Find. Take the, the modified F hand shape and as if you're finding something on the ground and picking it up. Find. Frustrated. Take the B hand shape, palm facing out, and put it to your chin as if you're being prevented from something because you're frustrated. Frustrated. Hit. Pretend this is a person and you're hitting that person. Hit. Good at. Take the F hand shape and put it on your chin. Um, good at. To be good at softball. Good at. Knowledge. The C hand shape up by your forehead and bring it out as if you have a lot of knowledge in your head. Not good at. You take your um, base hand, dominant hand in the five, put it in like this, and then bring your palm up. Not good at. Skill. Base hand is in the five, palm facing left or right. Dominant hand is um, in the cupped position and bring it out. Skill. Ticket, base hand, palm, dominant hand in the bent V, and as if you're clipping your base hand, as if you're punching the ticket, if you will. Woodworking, um, as if you're going back and forth with the sander maybe, uh, woodworking. Washington, this is in the, as in the state, um, Washington State and Washington DC. Take the W hand shape, and come off your shoulder. Washington. Chicago. Take the C hand shape and make it into a seven. If you're left-handed, it's like a backward seven. Chicago. Philadelphia. Same thing, but with the P hand shape. Philadelphia. Boston. Is with the B hand shape, palm going down. Boston. Detroit. It's with the D hand shape and the seven. You notice many cities are like this. Pittsburgh, just grab your, your shirt and pull it out. Pittsburgh. Atlanta, the A hand shape going across your body. Atlanta. Baltimore, the B hand shape, palm faces left or right if you're left handed and so if you're shaking someone's hand. Baltimore. History, it's with the H hand shape, and you um, go up and down with it. In the book, it shows that it's like this, so I'll accept either history or history. Math, it's with the M hand shapes, palm on top, and you go back and forth. Math. Art, it's with the palm, your base hand, palm faces up, dominant hand and the eye hand, eye hand shape, and then as if you're drawing. Art. English, 
base hand, palm faces down, dominant hand on top, and then pull it towards you. This is to speak English um, and to be from England as well. Science, it's as if you have two chemicals and you're pouring them into the beaker. So science. People with the P hand shapes, palm facing each other, and go out. You circle out. People. Platter. It's if this is the person and you're smothering them with flattery. Flatter. Enter. The base hand is in the C hand shape. Palm faces left or right. And then your dominant hand enters the C hand shape. So enter. Watch. Look at. Take the two hand shape. The dominant is close to your eye. And then it comes out with palms facing out. Look at. Hurt. Um, so with the one hand shapes, and then as you're twisting because of the pain, hurt. Become, palms face each other, and then you turn it around as if it started here and then it became something else. Become. Crash, as if these, um, your hands are objects and they come together and they crash. Crash. Hospital. Take the H hand shape and then draw a cross on your sleeve. Hospital. Past, like it happened in the past. Uh, five hand shape, palm faces back and move it behind you. Past. Dance, party. Um, five hand shape with your base hand. Your dominant is with the two and go back and forth as if your feet are swiveling back and forth. And finally, you take the one hand shape and palms face in, and then they come out. And you need to do the, it's called pa with your lips, and it looks like this. Finally. That's it for lesson two. Till next time.